Let's talk about two awesome, free, super quick tools to help you remove backgrounds from your photos. Now, we all know that there are tools that you can use like Photoshop, Illustrator, GIMP, but a lot of those tools are either not free or they're pretty complicated. Sometimes you just need to do something in like five seconds flat. And that's where remove.bg comes in. This is my most favorite tool ever. If you have a headshot or you've got something that you need to do for a client, um, it's so, so easy to manipulate the background. I'm gonna show you this example using a headshot. As you can see in like three seconds, it has already removed the background. Um, here is the original picture, just so you can see the difference. So upload five seconds or less, you've removed your background. And there are a couple more things that we can do with this. We can edit. Um, you can actually choose to keep your original background and blur the background. You can upload a completely different one. I think that this particular background change too is particularly handy if you do have a professional headshot that you're trying to upload, even choosing a soft white background or um, something gray. It does look a little more professional. Um, but let's go back to the blank background real quick. I wanna show you also how you can edit so let's just say it's, uh, you've uploaded a picture of your headshot and it's not quite right. It's pretty easy to restore. You come over here to this edit button and you start shading in the areas using your uh, trackpad or your mouse. You shade in some of the areas that you actually want to fix. And as you can see, it restores the background as you uh, glide over that. Um, very easy to undo if you make a mistake and it's equally as easy to erase if there are a few things that you'd like to get rid of that you don't think look good. You can always fine tune um, the changes that you see here. And when you're happy with your picture, you simply hit download and the image will get downloaded on your computer. And I want to show you too how easy it is to use it on your phone. Remove.bg works really well on your phone too. Um, you simply follow the same steps. You're going to upload an image. It's going to ask for access to your library. You're gonna upload it and bing, bang, boom, in literally less than two seconds, your background has once again been deleted. The second app that I wanna show you is for your phone only, and it's called Photo Room. A photo room is free, but for limited usage. So unlike remove.bg where everything is free, um, you can only use a couple features here. And I think that this photo room kind of shines in, uh, in the sense that it's good for like social media photos. So if you want to make your social media picture really pop, I think this is kind of a fun one. So we're looking at examples right here that they've done. Um, and these are all free. I'll show you how this works. So you're going to click, uh, once you've downloaded the app, you're going to click start from photo. You're going to upload the photo of your choice, and then you're going to watch the app kind of do its magical thing. Now, I don't think that photo room is as precise as remove.bg, uh, which is why I don't use it as often, but you do see that it is just as fast in removing the background. And then um, it does give you a couple options for uploading uh, or for choosing different backgrounds. So if there was a particular one that I liked for social media platforms, we'll just say this one. Um, so once you choose the picture that you like and you want to use for your social media, let's just say you can actually make a couple adjustments. If we go ahead and click on the central image, which is the person, you can uh, hit two fingers on your screen and enlarge. I like to do something like that because it um, in essence cuts off that kind of error that's on my shoulder, if you will. I think that looks fine. Um, we're going to go ahead and go, oops, forgot to save that bad boy. So we're, hello, click on person, going to enlarge, that's fine. The second thing we can do is change the background image. So we can uh, change that with a color. Once you're feeling happy with the way that your picture looks, you actually wanna look for this up arrow. I guess that's their download version. Um, now, as I mentioned, this is the free version that I'm using. So you do see that photo room down here. Um, to remove that, you'd have to pay to upgrade. Uh, but something I wanna show you real quick, I'm gonna go ahead and save this to files. I'm into my photos now, and what I'm going to do is simply edit on the phone and edit that out. There we go. Now, second to that, if you did want to remove the white background, of course, you could upload this whole piece back to background, uh, remove.bg, always an option. Or you can just simply upload this particular picture onto your social media platforms.
So there we go, two very quick, free, fast, easy ways to remove backgrounds that don't require any sort of coding or know-how for Photoshop, Illustrator, and some of those um, bigger tools.